hear me, can you uh, write a comment and we will be on our way. Can anybody hear me? If you can hear me, please reply in the comments. Okay, that's nice. <laughs> Can you also hear the music at the background, please? Can you give me feedback? Sorry, can you hear the music at the background? I need the feedback, guys. Okay, there's no background. stream up loud and clear and uh, so that we can start
Okay, um, let's get started now. Um, thank you for joining this webinar, and it's a great, great pleasure and honor to be taking you on this tutorial. So I'm going to be showing you five practical ways to make money online and what to do online and what not to do online. So it's possible that you are going to take something very interesting home today and uh, you are going to learn one or two things to boost your online money making career. Okay. So There, there are quite a few things that you shouldn't do online and uh, I'm going to tell you why you shouldn't do that online and uh, some of those things are pretty what most people do when they say they are looking for how to make money online. One of the first things you shouldn't do online is that you shouldn't uh, in any way you shouldn't in any way try to look for the you shouldn't look for the quickest way to make money online. To make money online. And uh, in fact what you should do is to is for you to I build a business slow and steady till it gets to a point where your income increases and keep increases and keeps increasing increasing and increasing and increasing. So most thing that a lot of all we guys do is that we see a money money making venture and we just slide into it and um, it is very wrong and I, I'm, I'm going to show you uh, practically what you can do to make money online okay so let's be serious and get into it straight away okay so there are some things you shouldn't do online and the first thing is that uh, all those um, make uh, quick schemes that you make used to make money. Uh, I am I'm, I'm saying that you should abandon them because at the long run they don't pay you. Okay, things like uh, where they will tell you that you should fill in emails for you to get paid. Things that they will tell you to quickly enter your and surveys, all the surveys, all those things. I want you to look for a way to not to them again because it's a time waster. It's a time waster and it will not make you the money that you want to make. Okay. Now, to make money online, you have to have something to offer. I don't know why people think that they will make a lot of money online when they don't have anything to offer. And that is the reason why you are always looking for a method to make money online. So I find it very absurd that a, a couple of guys comes to tell me that, bros, what is the, what is, what can I do to quickly make money online? What's the, what's the quick, quickest method now to make money online? So I feel very, I feel very offended by that because I feel that you shouldn't even be looking for a method to make money online because uh, when you are building a business, that is a method on its own. Okay, so I'm going to show you, uh, let, let, let me put down some of the things that people do to make money online. Okay, so one of those things is people actually do affiliate marketing. 
make money online. People actually freelance. And number three, people actually do e-commerce. I'm going to explain to you every one of them. And I'm, I'm sure you will take one or two things uh, this night that you will add to your business uh, if, if you're doing any of those. Okay, so people actually do e-commerce. People actually do uh, uh, content publishing. And uh, people actually do content publishing. Uh, you can call it uh, information publishing. But let me say people actually do content publishing. And number five, I'm going to, I said five practical ways. So I'm going to add, um, what else, what else, what else? I've, I've added freelancing, yeah. Um, okay. Um, that would be, people actually do consulting. Okay, so consulting to make money online. Okay, so <clears throat> if you can, if you are following me, please use the comments uh, box to tell me that you are following me. Okay. So if you are following me, please let me know. So I'm going to take every one of this, uh, every one of this uh, method I've written down here, and I'm going to give you what you can do immediately and start to make money. So if you follow me practically and those practical steps, I'm going to dish out this night. In uh, a month, you should be making your own money straight up. Okay, there's a reason why I didn't put plugin here. A lot of people think that, and a lot of people think uh, think that plugin is a way to make money online. Okay, so I like to think that blogging is born out of passion, and it's for you to just post something online out of what you like. If you are like people that think that blogging is something that will give you money, then you are probably going to do it wrongly and do a lot, waste a lot of your time. Okay, so uh, because a lot of people have seen that uh, Linda Ikeji is a blogger and she is making it big, well, she got she got into blogging when blogging isn't very popular in Nigeria. So she actually uh, was very fortunate to be there. But now everybody wants to be like Linda Ikeji and it's it, you will very struggle hard. Okay, so anybody again, I am seeing Ike Emmanuel. Thank you for commenting. Anybody there that can comment so that we just break all these things, break it down straight up. So let me know so that I can continue. Is anybody there? Is anybody listening? Thank you. 
Okay, so let's continue. Okay, so I'm going to take affiliate marketing and I'm going to a little break it down. Uh, most of my tutorial today will be more of talking and I'm not going to be putting a lot of notes down. So today I'm going to be talking about affiliate marketing. Okay, so it's very simple and straightforward and uh, since we call it the practical so i'm going to do a little google search and so that you can see it yourself what affiliate marketing is about um let me find a little bit of an image to show you. Okay, so uh, the idea is that someone has a product and wants to sell that product, but he doesn't have the expertise to sell this product. And now you come in as an affiliate marketer and tell the person that, hey, I want to help you to sell your product because I have the expertise to sell products and so why don't i sell this your product while i get a commission okay so you can see there's a base word there uh why i get a commission on your product so if your product is 100 naira i will sell it on your behalf then i'll take a commission of maybe say 20 naira why you take it in Naira. So companies use affiliate marketers to promote their product because they know that affiliate marketers will promote their products well while they take the cuts. So in, in layman, that is the meaning of affiliate marketing. So uh, I'm going to show you practical ways for you to just do affiliate marketing and the kind of company that you can join for your affiliate marketing and what how you can just set up this affiliate marketing system that you can now use to start making money online almost immediately okay so there are lots of affiliates mark um, there's a lot of sites that you can join that do affiliate marketing and you can see a wide range of products on this site that you can just pick and then do affiliate marketing for. So the popular ones that you know uh, uh, is uh, an example is ClickBank. You have JVZoo. Okay, so if you and some CPA marketing companies actually do affiliate marketing, but uh, something like Monich. Uh, something like Adwork Media. Yes, Adwork Media is a CPA company, uh, and but they have some affiliate products in there that you can promote. Very high quality um, product that you can promote. Okay, so um, so now when you want to, when you are an affiliate marketer, you need to have something they call a niche. So um what is a niche a niche is an area uh, it is like a topic that you are really good at that you want to promote products uh, in so if you are related to if you are like health health stuff so that means you'll be promoting health products for example so if i'm a doctor for example and I have a lot of patients. Uh, my product will probably that we're promoting will probably be health products, for example. So if I'm a, a doctor, I can easily tell my patients that um, there's a product that is really good for you. The supplement, of course, it will help you to gain more vitamins and minerals in the body, and you will, you won't even be sick like you normally do. And in fact, it's going to reduce how much you and 
spend in the hospital after you get sick. So if you can get this product, then it's going to improve your immune system and you are going to fight against uh, this common disease that brings you to the hospital. Okay, so I, as a doctor, have been able to sell that product to that patient because number one, the patient sees me as an authority and number two, I was able to give the uh, patient the benefits of that product. Okay, so if the patient buys that product, then I'm going to get a commission for it. So now you understand what a niche is. Okay, so there are health niches and um, there's another niche that they call the make money online niche. Now the make money online niche uh, is you can is a niche where a lot of people are there that wants to make money online. So what if you have products that help them make more money online, that increase their revenue online? So we see the make money online niche. These are one of these are the hottest niches you can find on the internet. Are you following me? Are you following me? Okay, so all right, let's go. Um, now that um, we know some of these niches, put in mind that you have the health niche, you have the make money online niche, and there are lots of other niches that are on the internet. You can just enter JVZU or ClickBank and see a lot of products that you can promote. Okay, so how, let's say you are in the money, make money online niche and you see a product, how are you going to promote this product to that person, to people, for people to see it? Now, since you your affiliate marketing won't be physical, of course, you most um, a lot of time you are going to be doing your affiliate marketing on, on online. So how are you going to, uh, can you make people buy your affiliate products? So I'm going to talk about two, I'm going to talk about two methods. And uh, you, there's a way, there's something called the free traffic method and there's something that we call the paid traffic method. Okay, so before I talk about the free uh, traffic method, there's something I need to let you know. Now that you have found a product that you want to promote, let's say you are on JVZU and then you have found the product that you want to promote. Now, the next thing is to bring out that product and put it in a place that people is going to see it. Now, if you go to JVZU, JVZU is like a marketplace, a marketplace, and a lot of people go to a market. So you need to bring that product out of that market and then, uh, and then package it very well for them to sell. So that's the reason why when you are promoting affiliate product, you need something they call a landing page. You need something they call a landing page. So a landing page is a simple page that tells or propels a visitor to buy a product. So let's say you are in the health niche Let's say you're in the health niche and you are promoting something like FenQ. Okay, uh, for, the, for this FenQ, if you go to manage.com, you will see, you will see this product on manage, manage.com. You see this product exactly on manage. So let's, uh, I said it's going to be practical, so I'm going to be uh, talking about the practical. Okay, so let's say we 
are promoting thank you so thank you is a weight loss product it helps people reduce weight when they add, when they uh, when they take it when they take it it's like um, a pill and they take it and it reduces their weight uh, that's what they say on the product page okay so now a lot of people is not going to come over to manage to come and buy now when you apply to an affiliate company and uh, so that they will be able to know that you are actually promoting a product their products so that they will be able to give you your commission that you need one thing they will give you is you will have an affiliate link they'll give you something called an affiliate link and this affiliate link has tracking codes that will point so let's say uh somebody buys using your affiliate link so that you'll be able to get the commission you deserve they put a tracking link in your affiliate link so that they will know that this affiliate got this sale so when you want to promote a product so look forward for the affiliate link or they call it a tracking link that uh, it's used to track someone that a sale is from somebody so let's say you just throw your link to a facebook group anybody that clicks on that link and goes to the landing page and buys actually and uh, you'll be credited for that sale because he buy he, he bought it through your affiliate link okay now that you have your affiliate link the one thing you need is a landing page. Okay, so a landing page tells people about that product. So it tells people about that product. People actually know things about that product. Okay, so uh, let me do be a little bit practical. So. Uh, let me find thank you. Okay, so <clears throat> excuse me. So the, uh, I want to load thank you landing page. Okay, so this is the official landing page for thank you. And this is it. And uh, in fact, what what will be on this uh, what will be on this landing page alone will be things that we want you to buy uh, buy something on that we want you to buy that we want you to and something that we want you to just buy from this website and in fact you'll be seeing testimonials you see uh, people that uh, lost weight, blah blah blah. How I lost weight, and you see, oh, excuse me. You see, one bottle is sixty nine ninety five, and two bottles is one thirty nine ninety. So they have an FAQ. They have a FAQ, and okay, so. This is the official landing page. <clears throat> and so you need one if you want to promote uh, an affiliate product. So now this is what I do. So let's say I have thank you. I know other people are promoting this. So what I'll do is just look forward to people that are trying to promote uh, thank you. Okay. so. Because thank you is a health product, what people actually do mostly is to do a review page for thank you. So what people will do is that they will do it like it's an honest review of thank you. So let's go, uh, let's go to this and see. 
Okay, this guy actually bought a domain. Thank you, avis.com. Thank you, dash avis.com. Okay, so he bought the thank you. So he wants to promote only this product. Uh, it's promoting uh, other products that looks like it. Okay, so he puts a disclaimer, what you're about to read is my personal opinion of the product. I've gathered information, blah, 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 story for the gods. Now, if you look at this side, it's a little bit, it's a little uh, banner that says find out more. If you click on this, it's going to probably take you to where you can buy thank you. So that means people that comes to this website is going to buy from him. And you see that this guy is ranking on the first page of Google. And let's say, let me, let me make it a little bit practical. Oh no, you can't see it. Uh, because I'm not sharing that place uh, screen. Okay, so <coughs> excuse me. When you click on it, it's going to take you. It, it has its own affiliate link there. It's going to take you to uh, the uh, where you can buy. Thank you. So if if anybody buys thank you there, they are going. To, it's going to get a commission for that. Okay, so he wrote a small post and. Obesity has created a blah, 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 blah thing. Okay, so what you should do is that, let's say you want to promote an health, a health product, what you should do is to find a, an article, a review article. So where you can buy a review article from, you can get one from Fiverr, just pay $10, you can, uh, I'm sure, I'm sure this uh, this this guy maybe he has about 1,500 words. Uh, SEO optimized article. Uh, uh, SEO optimized article is an article that is optimized for search engine. And what he also did is to do a review video of thank you. If we play it, it's going to be a review video of thank you. Hi everyone, I would like to tell you about a weight loss supplement that I encountered. Well, to be honest, a friend of mine told me about it. So, uh, you can also do a review video. You can uh, go over to fiverr.com also, and then so get someone to do a review video. If I click on it, it's going to go to youtube.com and you will see you will see a link to where you can buy thank you so it is actually getting traffic from youtube and it's also getting traffic from this site okay so so what he's doing is actually it's dedicated this um website on thank you okay if you see some of his had articles here too so it has a whole blog on thank you. So that is actually smart. You can see he has a lot of views. This guy is going to be selling a lot from thank you. So you can actually model what he's doing and just keep doing it. Okay. And he reviewed thank you there. Okay, so Let's go back. Okay, so uh, I've explained to you how uh, that you should get a landing page. Um, sorry, I hope I said, okay, here, yeah, yeah. So you, you, I told you to have a landing page and uh, once you have a landing page and uh, I've shown you the kind of content you probably will put on your landing page, things that will make people buy that product and they will buy that product from you. Okay, now, so, so let's talk about traffic. So now, now that you have a, a landing page, you will want to pull in some traffic to your landing page so that people are going to get into 
your landing page and probably will buy from you. Okay, are you, um, is anyone, uh, if you are listening, let me, uh, can you write a comment so, so that I know and continue. Okay, so um, thank you, uh, Leah, Elias Abkimbola, whatever <laughs> your name. Okay, so Chidubem Okoye Dumdum. Thank you for listening. Um, so, um, okay, so I'm talking about traffic, and the first thing is your free traffic and pay traffic. Okay, uh, the best places you can get free traffic from are social media. And those are your best bet because uh, social media is a community of um, uh, of people, so they come there to have fun, and you can actually just sell to them. On social media, so uh, social. So if you are promoting like um, health products, you are likely going to use um, Facebook, and you are probably going to use YouTube, Twitter, and um, Instagram, and Instagram. Okay. So um, on Facebook, you, what you can do is um, what you can do is to create a Facebook page, and once you have a Facebook page, what you need to do is to name it in that niche. So uh, the example we are using is thank you, and so you are going to have a page dedicated to weight loss. So you will find a cool way to do a weight loss. So how can you promote on Facebook? So you will try to build a kind of authority um, uh, with a Facebook page. You will get some good testimonials and pictures and you post it and you keep posting on the Facebook page. So you will want to grow your Facebook page by just um, promoting on uh, related groups. So since it's a web loss page, you just enter a group and write a very good post that people there can reach. When they read the post, then you will put a link to your Facebook page there and people can actually like and see your content, okay. Now, one of the tools I like to use is uh, these days is a chatbot. Chatbots are actually nice yeah, because they look like your bucket where you put people interested in what you do in, into. So when you gather those people in a bucket, kind of, you can easily sell to them. So you can send a broadcast message to people that are in your chatbot. So in fact, what I advise is that when you are promoting your, when you want to promote your Facebook page in those groups, 
what you should actually be promoting is your chatbot link it's because you know that anybody that clicks on your link automatically becomes a subscriber so when they become your subscriber what you can do is to send them uh, videos send them articles of results from let's say you are doing thank you from the thank you that you are promoting you will see that a lot of people are going to respond to that so that's a good way so for youtube if you are doing youtube marketing you will you will know that you are dealing with a, a lot of people on youtube so the first thing you need is um the first thing you need is a video and how to do that you can go over to fiverr and find someone that will do a video testimonial for you so i am searching i'm going to fiverr.com fiverr.com um so when you go over to fiverr.com you will search for somebody that does video testimonials so let's find the service called video testimonial on this 3d we need okay most times they make it spokesperson uh we preferably like a skinny girl is just 25 dollars so what you need to do is to contact a lady like this and tell them that you need a video testimonial of your a video testimonial like a video review of the promo product you are promoting like thank you you just find someone a little skinny so something like this and this is just five dollars so you just contact them and tell them you need a video every this is another girl it's just fifteen dollars so they will tell them so what they will do is they will kind of review um the product and say it works and you can now put on youtube okay so now uh putting the video on youtube is one thing making people buy from the link and i mean ranking that video on youtube is another thing so one of the things that make a video rank on YouTube is when it has a fully optimized, a fully optimized um, keywords, when it's fully optimized with keywords. And so you want to use the keyword of this thank you in your video. And another thing is that um, you will want to buy quality links to your video so that it ranks. And then you put in some social. Um, so what I recommend is you should buy, if you are promoting affiliate products, you will buy some views. Also, you will uh, buy some social signals. Signals, and the third thing is you buy some quality uh, backlinks to it, so quality backlinks to it, and you can get them at uh, www.seoclark.com. Okay, just get them, and your video is going to rank when it's fully optimized. So, if you want to optimize your with keywords, and you can use something like um, a software called Tubejit. You can search for the crack brush online too and how to use it online. Yeah, you will always get that. Okay. Are you getting me? Should I continue or not?
uh, can you highlight in the comments so that I'll continue with the free traffic and once I'm done with the free traffic we can call it a day on this live webinar we can next Saturday we will have another uh, session that we will use okay all right okay thank you chidu bem okoy dum dum all right ike emmanuel thank you very much okay so uh when i'm done with the free traffic and the paid traffic we can then ask all the questions you want to ask boom <clears throat> okay so uh, for the free traffic, what you need to do, uh, pay traffic, is now oh, when you are running ad, you will probably run ad, run advertising. Yeah, um, you will be running advertising. That and when you want to run advertising, you are going to need some money. And I'm going to tell you the kind of advertising that works. Um, all right, I know you. a lot of people want you to use, are telling you to use Facebook ads for running affiliate products, something sensitive uh, as um, if it's health products, it's very sensitive and running advertising to those kind of products can get you banned. But, um, but what should you should do is that you should run native ads. And it's actually the future of advertising. Uh, do I say future? It actually converts well for now, All right? So native ad, ads actually convert well. So another thing that you can buy is, and you can buy solo ads. Solo ads also convert well. Solo ads also convert well. So let me just talk about solo ads for now. Um, and give me a minute while I search for a resource I put down. Okay, so I'm going to give you like three solo ads vendors you can buy from and and how to use them. Okay, so I'm so you uh, solo ad vendors you can use is uh, at this click Z, sorry, click Z.com, traffic for me.com, human eyeballs. Come, these guys are. A little bit recommended. Okay, so the idea of a solo ad is that uh, people have lists and they have those lists, but you don't have a list. The the list I'm talking about are email e e email lists. They have the audience, so they what they do is they are offering to send your offer to their email list. So when you go to any of these sites, you see a vendor that also wants to sell a solo, a solo ad. They can say that they are sending solo ads like to, they are promising 500 clicks for $100. That is very cool. Uh, let's say your, let's say thank you commission gives you $40. And out of 500 people that clicks on your 500 people that clicks on your that clicked on your uh, solo ad, like about three to four people buys at forty dollars. Forty times three is about one twenty dollars, and you are spent like hundred dollars. Yes, so you have a profit of $20. Now, you are thinking that that is very small, but the what you should do when you are sending solo ads is that 
instead of sending them to your landing page straight, what you will be sending them to an opt-in page. So an opt-in page is a page where people enter their email address. So once you send them to your opt-in page, they will enter their email address. And after they enter their email address, then you can show them the offer. Now, the reason why you have to put it an opt-in page is that you will want to, you already have those audience. So instead of paying again to send to that same audience, they will just enter straight into your opt-in page, opt-in list, into your list, and you can promote to them. So those one that did not buy the first time, you can send emails to them and they will buy. In fact, on average, you have to send like four to five mails for someone to finally decide to buy. Okay, so that, that's what. So with that, you can keep growing your niche. Like your, if you're promoting health offers, you keep getting subscribers into your niche, into your um, list. Okay, so. Now let's talk about native ads. I'm going to show you something about native ads. And uh, you see, most times when you go to all these viral news sites, uh, all these viral news sites, you will see that, uh, let me find a viral news. I hope I can find it. Oh, I, did I? Yeah. Excuse me. This is it. Let me check this guy. This guy is ranking for Vian News. All right. So let me click on. Um, this guy, all right. Let me try. Why is it very slow? Excuse me, just give me a minute. Oh, it's loading my post. So I'm looking for uh, an idea of a, a native ad so that you can see. Uh, what a value site is. Wow. So what I have opened. Oh my God. Okay. Let me just stop here. So uh, let me try BuzzFeed. Bosvid and see if my example of a new site is there. Excuse me. Okay. Buzzfeed is very viral. I think they probably have like a million views every day. Or maybe I don't know what I'm talking about. Okay, so I found the link native ads. Uh, is it native? Okay, these are the native ads. Okay, so <coughs> native ads are those ads that you see on popular viral news sites, 
these new sites and these new sites have nothing less than 50,000 views every day. So after looking at an article, you will see that when you scroll down, you will probably see some of this, uh, some of these articles, some of these ads that are here. I'm not sure this is a native ad. Okay, you see, okay, this these are the ads. I saw something like advertising around there. Okay, advertisements, see? So they are advertisements and so imagine that you are running ads to show on some of these popular news sites and when people come to it, see something like, uh, when people click on it, they will come to your offer. You see that you'll be getting a lot of uh, clicks from those viral news sites. So that is the reason why native ad works. And you can do a little research on native ads. I'm not going to go deep into what's a native ads, but a native ad network that I recommend is Ref Content. So you can just set up a, a Ref Content account and then put in a few dollars and you can start promoting. Now, remember when you're promoting, uh, always make sure that you are pointing, uh, they come first to your opt-in page. They come first to your opt-in page before they now get to your offer, before they come to your landing page of what you're promoting, so that you will at least get their emails list and promote to them later before they buy. Okay, so I'm um, recommending Ref Content. You can sign up on Ref Content and see how they work. Okay, so, and that will be end, be the end of my tutorial this night. And um, if you have any question, please use the comments so that we can get them uh, answered before I say bye-bye to you guys. Okay, so if you have, your questions please type them well please type them so i can get them answered from anybody before I call it a night. If you have questions, please post in the comments and let's get them solved. Cheer, cheer, cheer. Uh -huh. Ooh. In the absence of uh, any question, I will uh, be calling this webinar to a close. And in case you have questions, you can always comment. I'm going to leave this video right here, and you can always view it later. And um, I'm going to call this a wonderful night. Have a nice rest. Good night, trust everybody, and we are going to 
have another session next week. We we'll probably we have a different uh, coach to take us through. Okay, so I'm ending the stream right now. Good night, everybody. <laughs>